Hey boys and girls, so like we talked about in our morning message, we're gonna be learning and reading about how animals even make their homes. They use different parts of their bodies to help make their homes nice and cozy for them. Now today we're gonna read this story. What do you think this story is about just by looking at the illustrations? Wow, that's a really awesome prediction. Let me tell you the title and see if you still feel that way. In the small, small pond. Hmm, now what do you think will happen in the story? Awesome. Yeah, let me tell you about a pond. A pond is a small area of water. It kind of looks like a pool, but it's out in nature. And that's where a lot of different animals live. And where animals live is called their habitat. Can you say habitat? Awesome. So the habitat or where the animals live in this story is the pond. Now their habitat might be the pond, but their homes are a little bit different. Now let me tell you what I mean by that. I believe these are crawfish. These crawfish, their habitat is the pond, but the, their home is at the bottom on the dirt of the pond. Okay, let me show you what else I mean. <laughs> These are beavers. Oh, muskrats, muskrats, sorry. Now their home or their habitat or where they live is around the pond, just like the crawfish, but their home is different. The muskrats live on the sand and they build a little hill and burrow made of sticks to make their home more cozy for them. So animals might have the same habitat, but they have different homes. Got it? All right, so while we're reading this story, I want you to be paying attention and looking at all of the illustrations to learn more about each animal's habitat. Turn on those listening ears. Cha-ching! All right, this story is called In the Small, Small Pond. In the small, small pond. In the small, small pond. Wiggle, jiggle, tadpoles wriggle. Tadpoles are baby frogs. Waddle wade, geese parade. Hover, shiver, wings quiver. Look at these dragonflies. Let's talk about this. Their habitat or where they live is around the pond, but their home is in the sky or they land on the pieces of grass. Drows, doze, eyes, close. Lash, lunge, here on Plunge. Splitter, splatter, minnows scatter. Circle, swirl, whirl a gigs, twirl. Sweep, swoop, swallow, scoop. Dabble, dip, tails, flip. Splish, splash, paws, flash. Pile, pack, muskrat, stack. Chill, breeze, winter, freeze. Cold night, sleep tight, small, small pond. The end. Round of applause. Awesome. Now that frog was all over the place in that story. Now let's talk about it. Now its habitat or where it lives is in the pond. But where is its home in, the, in its habitat? Where is its home? 
digs himself a nice big hole to stay warm in the winter. So his habitat is the same as all of these other animals, but his home is just a little bit different. So let's talk about these tadpoles. Tadpoles are baby frogs, and what are they doing? Right, they're swimming. I want you to tell me what is their habitat and where's their home? Hmm, what do you think? Yeah, their habitat is the pond, but their home is in the water. Now, all of the animals, their home isn't all in the water. Let me tell you what I mean. Where are we at? Sorry, kids, I lost my page. Okie dokie. Let's, there we are. The turtles. Now, this is what I want you to do. I want you to tell me about the habitat of the turtles or where they live around. And then tell me about their home that you see right here. Let me know below.